It's time for a very special episode of Sports Style Swipe. This week, we're welcoming special guest Dex Robinson to the show. Woo! Yeah, Dex. Welcome to Sports Style Swipe. Now, Dex is an athlete, stylist, and brand manager who has worked with such notable athletes as Sacramento Kings DeMarcus Cousins and Orlando Magic's Evan Fournier, Josie Altidore of the U.S. Men's National Team, and Cam Chancellor of the Seattle Seahawks. We'll be picking Dex's brain on men's fashion to give you guys some tips and tricks to look your best. And with me to keep the conversation going are two of our own stylish studs, in-house fashion expert and co-founder of the website Nap Dress for the Day, Anisha Mukherjee, and it's a bird, it's a plane, no, it's SI's Rohan Medkarni. Now Dex, we look at a lot of red carpet fashion images. What's your inspiration for choosing how to get guys ready for the red carpet? So I kind of look at the style that they came, when they met me, what they had coming into the situation. So that way I can just essentially elevate it. A lot of guys, since their teammates and other uh, people that may be in their camps or maybe uh, getting more into fashion, they're looking like, okay, well they're in fashion, I need to be in fashion. These guys are natural born competitors. Sure. So it's like, hey, you know, his clothes look good, mine needs to look better than his, and also my car. So <laughs> I typically like just kind of play off of what they come in having and then just make it better. Are there any guys that come in where you're just like, no, this isn't gonna work. We need to completely <laughs> transform Listen, your image. <laughs> for sure. <laughs> what are the five pieces every guy must have in their closet this season? So this season, the five pieces that I feel like every guy should have mm -hmm. uh, would have to be a Stan Smith. Stan Smiths yes. are like yes. a classic sneaker. You can dress them up or dress them down. Two would have to be a loose fitting trouser. Loose fitting trousers are like kind of coming back around, but more tailored in a sense. So like maybe in the 90s where jeans and things were like baggy. It's like doing that, but with a tailored cut so the silhouette is not too off and it doesn't look too, I guess, urban in a sense. Dad hats are coming back. Yeah. Uh, so yeah, so those are something that, I mean, everyone is making cool baseball hats. You know, something easy to throw on if you have hair like myself and you just want to throw on a hat. Another piece, bomber jackets are super cool. Yeah. So like a lightweight bomber jacket is something that you can always have at nighttime, right? So when you go to the club, when you're entering, you can have a look. At least you can take it off when it gets hot. It's all you know, about the look walking like, in. Exactly. Yeah. So you get your walk-in look, take a couple snaps, a couple pictures. <laughs> then take it off and then you have like a t-shirt under or something like that. And probably the last um, but not least is a distressed hair denim. Mm -hmm. Piff on exactly. trend. I'm telling you, distressed denim is amazing because you can do it with a cool Chelsea boot, the pair of Stan Smiths that I told right. you about, or you can do like a cool brogue like I'm wearing with it. Do a little cuff, maybe do like a Oxford shirt okay, and so. go, you know? So mm -hmm. I definitely feel like those are the five pieces that I would suggest for any men's wardrobe. What are your go-to stores for shopping for these guys? So I'm very much a high-low guy, yep. right? So I try to, again, teach them more about style. Mm. And style is not necessarily brand, right? right. So uh, if, when you have style, you can get things from a thrift store, yep. from Gap, from H&M, and again, mix it up with a couple high-end pieces and make the look look super luxe. Where do you see the future of fashion, especially amongst professional athletes? The thing is, like with athletes, that shelf life is not that long. So these guys are trying to figure out, what can I do to actually make revenue mm -hmm. without throwing or catching a ball, right? right? And fashion has seemed to open arms, welcome these guys, and they are like, hey, if they, they like me, then why not? I'm right. gonna come in if I can create a check without actually having to do much, but get dressed and this is what I do on a daily basis, then why not? These guys hold so much influence. Mm. Uh, they have like the power of influence and I'm telling you, over the next couple years, it's about to skyrocket and these guys are about to kill the game. So Dex, we're gonna do a little social experiment on our buddy Rohan over here. <laughs> do you wanna stand up, Rohan, and show our yeah, viewers no, your amazing outfit? Care. So Dex, what's hot, what's not, how would you improve it, what should he keep? So I would have I would have probably suggested that he did like a deep navy trouser okay. just to kind of play off of the blue hue in the shirt. With that metallic contrast, that would have been super sick. I definitely like the fit of the trouser, like like I said, loose trousers are pretty much in, so he's not feeling all stuffy and like sweaty to get some air to breathe when he's like walking <laughs> out, especially in this heat. Yeah. 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 Like this heat East is so Coast intense. Heat. True. So yeah, I, I mean, I think this is cool. All right. Yeah. Uh -huh. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Yeah. So we'll give him like what, a B plus? Is he going to get B plus? Yeah, I'll give him like a B 
Mm -hmm. See, all right. <laughs> <laughs> That's it for this week's Sports Style Swipe. Thank you so much, Dex, yeah, for coming on the show and me. for sharing your fashion expertise. <laughs> you can follow Dex on Twitter and Instagram for more fashion fun at DexRob. And also make sure you check out our lightning round on Extra Mustard's Facebook page, guest starring Dex, as we look at some of the fashion from this year's ESPY. Until next time.